Hello everybody and welcome to The Beaver Boys! In uh, this episode we are going to take what some may call a trash bird. Everybody calls it a trash bird. The common merganser. It's so bad. I don't want to do this. <laughs> so we actually shot these birds ourselves, cleaned them, all that fun stuff. And we are going to prepare them two different ways. Over an open fire and on a smoker. And I have created a concoction a few days ago, uh, homemade pickle juice, because we had a friend say either milk or pickle juice to take that fishy flavor out. Um, so that has been marinating for two days and I am quite scared because it looks disgusting. This is gonna suck. So let's get started. <laughs> Why is it so hard? Oh, it's like yellow. Oh, God. This is so bad. Oh, gosh. Why are we doing this? Oh. <laughs> oh, There's just no way that's going to be good. Dude, they look rotten. Smell it. So soaking in pickle juice for two and a half days. Don't do it. Is not a good idea. Still not great. No, but comparatively. Yeah. <laughs> it's when you smell just fishiness and you think that smells okay. Guys, I just wanted to say that uh, we've cleaned a lot of deer. We've, uh, and animals. And animals. Squirrels, rabbits. Um, and I can't remember the last time that I, uh, that I almost chucked. But that was it. That was, that was very close. All right, now that we got the uh, smoker going and the flames are going, it's time to let this merganser fly. <sighs> Let's uh. get this over with. Remember to like and subscribe. Do it! All right, so we finished the smoking process and the cooking over the fire process. And if I could describe to you all what this smells like. First off, while it was over the fire and that smoke twirled around and it smacked you in the face, it smelled like straight rotten fish. It's bad, people. It's really bad. It's really bad. Um, if you didn't know what it was, you would be excited because the skin is beautifully scorched. Um, it's really well cooked, uh, to medium. It looks great. And it looks great. The smoke has a beautiful smoke ring. Um, but it smells awful. It smells like hot trash yeah. and it's invading my personal space. Yeah. As you remember learning, like they mainly, they eat a lot of fish and it smells like it. It's bad. So we are going. Oh, uh, I don't want to do it. To give this a try. I'm going to give it, I'm going to take a bite of it. I'm going to take a bite of a piece because your, I didn't think it was your, small. Your first this, instinct this is when one. you see something like this is to grab a nice big juicy piece. This is folly. This is, it's gonna suck so bad. Oh, 
Oh, All right, our first one we're gonna try is the one over the fire. And I'm not even, I don't think I'm gonna put the whole thing, but I think I'm gonna just take a bite of it. Cause it just smells so I just bad. Wanna... And we left the skin on, and like we said, it's it scorched really <laughs> well. <laughs> that was not a smart move, I'm not doing that. I already smelled Dude, it. you have to smell it. I'm gonna gag. All right, here we go. <laughs> There it uh, is. <laughs> I was about to say it. Coming back out. Yep. Uh, 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 oh. Oh. God. Ah. Okay. I was about to say that it really wasn't that bad. Because um, at first it didn't really taste that bad. It has a nice bite. Um, chew. Yeah. And the rotten fish taste comes in. Yeah. At first, it, it was really nice because you you tasted that char, the char, the salt, the pepper, the, the skin, and then it hits you like a ton of bricks that there is a rotten fish in your mouth, and it's stayed in there. It's still it's, in there. It's still in there. I don't. I'm gonna get rid of the next piece because we're gonna try this next piece, and then I'm gonna. Oh, you're going for the big one. I'm gonna bite a piece off the big <laughs> don't one. Don't do it. I'm gonna have to do it too now. And <laughs> this is the smoked piece, as you can see. Looks great. Looks really, it looks really looks red good. And just good color. Cheers. Smell. No. Sweet. Smell it. Oh, oh, I'm gonna throw oh it. my god. <laughs> oh my god. All right, we're doing it. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> right, I got what? tenderness um, I feel like I've been beat up but it tasted like a rotten fish it's so bad people so I think that the um whew, I think that that ginger's helping enough yeah it burns it burns really it burns good so good yeah. <laughs> um, so I would believe everybody and all those recipes online that say, you know, the best way to cook berganser is on a plank of wood and you throw away the berganser and eat the piece of wood. Yeah. I can see why. But I don't think I'd want to eat that piece of wood because it would have the fishy juice of the merganser on it. It's bad. It is bad. It's that bad. So, uh, it tastes... We got it. Let us know in the comments whether you've had it good and if there actually is a good way to... It's prepare merganser There's no because problem. I don't see that there is, but I've seen people have claimed it. Let's try to actually describe this smell. Fish, like rotten fish. Like it smells, it is the freshest duck. I had it frozen, I thawed it out. You know that um, if you're like fishing and you see like a dead fish washed up. On seaweed. Like yeah. on on shore on seaweed, and, and you get that like, and then you like pick it up, yeah. and you're like, oh, I wonder if it's fresh. And that that it wasp of rottenness that yeah. comes on you, yeah. But it has the the same tenderness as a duck, a normal duck, like like a good duck. But ladies and gentlemen, that is not, <laughs> that is not where it's at. It is foul. That is foul. Um, that trash. Bird belongs in the trash. Belongs in the trash. Zero out of ten. Zero out of ten. Keep that as coyote bait or dog food. Yeah. I mean, dogs like it, I'm sure. Yeah. They'll eat anything. But not me. No. Let's never do that again. 
Yeah, agreed. Mm. So you heard it first on the Beaver Boys. Throw them away, people. Or don't shoot them. Or don't shoot them. Everybody, I'm excited to tell you we have found the secret recipe that makes merganser taste good. Are you ready? Voila. All good. <laughs>